what, what the mate is talking about. Yeah. What's up, family? I got a doozy for you. An African man is going viral after he hosted a baby shower for not one, not two, not three, not four, not five, but six women who he calls his girlfriends. He started off in Africa going viral. And now he has swept all across the continent and beyond. Pretty Mike is his name. That's what he calls himself. Pretty Mike. Pretty Mike not only had a baby shower for his six girlfriends, he invited their family members and friends. He even invited his male friends who did not know, some of them did not know, that he had more than one girlfriend. So imagine the shock when they saw these other five women stepping out. He greeted them one by one and rubbing their bellies. And they seemed happy. They had the lavish ceremony at one of the most expensive hotels in Lagos, Nigeria. There are women out there who are calling those women dumb. Some men are too. What I want to know is, fellas, would you do it? If you could, would you do it? Is it you? Ladies, could you see yourself in that type of relationship? Now, I know some people are saying, what kind of question is that? God said, only one. You pick one and that's it. Fam, you know, there are some very religious people who have multiple wives, multiple husbands, boyfriends, girlfriends, you name it. So let's try to look at the upside of this, if there's an upside, you know. I mean, just hypothetically speaking, upside. All of the women under the same roof. He's going to raise his kids under the same roof. They're not baby mamas and side chicks. They respect each other. They respect the union. They're all happy. Who are we to judge them? Downside. If he's not married to those women, then they are baby mamas and side chicks. If he's not up to it, and I mean figuratively and literally speaking, what is a woman to do? What if he run out of gas after the third one? Do the fourth and the fifth one have to wait? Or do they go somewhere else to find some good loving? The kids, how does one man take care of six kids by six different women simultaneously? Let's say they're not under the same roof because we're only assuming that they're under the same roof, right? What if they're not? I have a hard enough time just doing what I'm supposed to do with my, my two that I raised under the same roof. Can he give each one of those kids the love, the attention, the coaching, the counseling, the attention that they need? What happens, God forbid, if he brings back some type of 
disease or one of them, you know, and are they loyal? It's, you know, I know that there are many women that have, that are in these type of relationships, but it is very hard for me to believe that all of those women are going to remain loyal for the duration of the relationship while they're in the relationship the entire time. That is very hard for me to believe. I think in the beginning, a woman may be able to do that, but at some point, she is going to venture off somewhere into a social service office or she's going to go to a party with one of her friends or something. And she's going to be talking to a neighbor, something. If she has a job, she'll be, somebody's gonna get in her ear and say, girl, are you a fool? You crazy. Are you stupid? And then her mind's gonna start wondering. And you know how that goes. But let's cut through the chase, fam. Let's cut to the chase. What would you do? Could you do it? Could you allow it? And fellas, what if the shoe was on the other foot? Would you be with a woman? Well, you was the extra man, or you down the line, maybe you number three or four. Could you do it? I couldn't do it. I couldn't do it. I wouldn't want to do it. I kind of like monogamy. I like the idea of just showering one woman with gifts and attention, love. I like that. I'm cool with that. I know it seems like it's more than one of me at times because I'm so debonair, but you know, I'm cool with it. I'm cool with just one woman. When you work like I do, and you are involved in family and friends' lives, you know, you know it ain't a whole lot of time in the day. And I think that, uh, I personally think that everybody that you have a serious relationship with deserves to have all of you. All of you as a friend, all of you as a romantic partner, all of you as a brother, a father, whatever. That's just how I'm operating, fam. That's, that's the way I'm built. But what say you? Could you do it? Drop a comment. No more talk. What the haters talking about?